Hi, this is Sam from Sand Strings, and today I'm going to be playing uh, this new workshop show we just finished up here in the shop. Um, it's based loosely on a strad pattern. Um, it has European spruce tops, poplar sides, and back. Um, I'm going to play this a little bit for you, but also kind of give you some experience that I've continued to grow with, I guess you could say, um, with new instruments. <laughs> Just when I think I know it all, <laughs> which of course is absurd, um, I'm constantly surprised by nature. And what I mean by that is uh, instruments are handmade by people uh, with national materials, um, and they're all unique. Um, so uh, when I first picked up this child today, I was like, yeah, it sounded pretty good. Um, but I felt like it just you know, wasn't responding, uh, and I just kept playing it, kept you know, enjoying the music that came out of it, and lo and behold, it starts opening. Um, and that's the, really the thing with new instruments is that uh, you really need to learn to listen to them, what they're telling you. Um, obviously, an instrument is not going to be dramatically, you know, dark to bright or bright to dark all of a sudden. Um, but uh, with a new instrument, there's a lot of growth. Uh, so when you find a cello you're, or an instrument you're intrigued in, I'd encourage you to, you know, give it a good 15 minutes. Really play it. Uh, investigate it. In many ways, you might find out there's a new musical phrase you haven't thought about as you're uh, you know, exploring that instrument. So, um, anyway, back to this cello. Sorry, my little rant there. Um, what I like about this cello is we have a lot of power. We really, you know, kind of push quite a bit. But it gets a really a nice warm uh, A string um, that still gives me the bite. Sharp attack. Um, here's a little bit of uh, something different. So you can see, um, you get the articulation when you need it. You get the warmth when you need it. Um, it's really, it's a really fine cello. I'm excited to have it here in the shop, um, and I'd love to show it to you. So please uh, come by and give it a whirl. Thanks. <laughs> 